Good afternoon YouTube, it is Thursday. No, I haven't just woken up. I've been up for a while, I just haven't been doing a lot of vlogging. In terms of updates with me moving to London, I have a viewing. <laughs> just one at the moment. Um, it is for a place trying to throw myself off the chair then. <laughs> I've got one viewing for uh, Tuesday in a couple of weeks, which is really nice. So I can't wait for that one. Um, the confirmation of time and the place is gonna be confirmed Monday the 23rd. So that's one place. Uh, there's two places that I really like the look of. That's for an agent. I have to go physically to the agency and uh, request a viewing and other places there. So I'm gonna do that because luckily, Monday I have to, Monday the 23rd, I have to drop stuff in to um, head office and get all that sorted and obviously sign the contract and stuff like that um, with uh, uh, human resources or HR. Um, so, and luckily it's in the same kind of area, so it would just be a quick trip on the tube and then hopefully I can look at a couple of places. One of them is a studio flat. I really want it. It's it's small, it's a little bit dark, but I can brighten it up. I mean, I've got this bad boy. So, you know, I can brighten it up and I really like it. So, fingers crossed. <laughs> the room does this thing where you can go to like speed flat mate meetings. I know it's a bit dorky, but it's really useful. It's done every Wednesday evening. So, going to apply to the one where I'm going to be up, obviously the day after because I just got an email today for next week's so hopefully next Thursday I'll get an email for the week after and that's the one I want but other than that what else is going on um yes I'm in my sewing room I'm currently uh in the midst of sewing a circle skirt and I'm doing the pockets there we are that's the costume so far it's going really well I'm getting lots of footage um as well for uh some more time cosplay time lapse videos i haven't done a lot of videos um i'm mostly just doing the vlog so i can keep you guys up to date um i've got one to do one i've filmed for o japan which is the lucky dips which i go into more details about lucky dips so i will hopefully edit that tonight and put it up tomorrow um they had a special sale on which I got my Optimus Prime uh, Panda t-shirt so I finally got that. I'm so happy. I was like, I'm supposed to be saving but I'm so buying. Um, my Kickstarter stuff hasn't arrived from the uh, Thunderbird special episodes. Hopefully, I, I really want it to arrive um, by next Saturday because then I'm up in London and I want to have it while I'm in London and hopefully I get a new place so it's one thing I'm definitely taking is my Blu-ray player and my little TV but yeah not else as much going on family has gone to Barcelona they left yesterday morning at four o'clock in the morning just we won't just they they got the flight through Ryanair and it was meant to be eleven o'clock in the morning from Bristol. Um and then they got an email a month uh, a month ago saying, Oh no, now it's this time in the morning. Seven o'clock in the morning and they had to be at the airport and drop their bags off by six. I know. It was ridiculous. So um they're all a bit annoyed. Um so they woke me up just uh yeah, yesterday morning. It's a bit annoyed, but I refuse to get out of bed, I'm like, yeah, bye, bye, I'm going get back to sleep. And then last night, the alarm clock went off in my parents' room, three o'clock in the morning. I've been asleep for three hours and I get thrown awake by the clock, so I actually need to text them and know how to switch the damn thing off. Because their clock is set by day, so it won't be activated by the weekend. And I suddenly thought it was Friday and it's not its first day today because it's my day off at work and I always have days off on Thursdays. <laughs> so I was like, oh, it's fine. Oh, no, wait, now I'll get woken up again. Ah, so I need to text them and know how to switch it off. So that basically means I have the house to myself. Yay! An entire seven days with no family. Um, just the Mr. Barky, which is the dog. Don't know where he is at the moment. He's, he's, some, he's somewhere. Um, so hopefully, I'm, I'm trying to get all the cosplay done. I really want to get this done by Saturday evening. And then hopefully uh, Sunday I can do the order recordings 
for all the um, first lot of time lapse videos that I've done and hopefully then it's just I can focus on doing lots of video content because I've got all my monthly box subscriptions I've got to do this week as well. Obviously I filmed them all, I just haven't edited them. I again apologise on the lateness of all of it, it's just everything is just barrel rolled and obviously I've got to write a list and work out what on earth I'm packing. Uh, yeah, so got a really big silver suitcase upstairs. Oh, I need to write a list for that. I hope I'll, I'll, I'll get it done. I'll get it done. It's not like I'm going to London next Sunday. Ah, I'm going to London next Sunday. <laughs> I have just come back from work, from cycling, from walking the dog, and what has arrived? Thunderbirds 1965 new episodes <gasps> so there is going to be a special unboxing tonight I cannot wait anyway let's get ready for it good evening YouTube it is Friday I am looking so glam looking so cute for the vlog no <laughs> No, I have just finished recording um, a new video because my Kickstarter rewards from the 1965 uh, recordings Kickstarter fund have arrived and I had to do a video for them because no way I was going to unbox them without you guys being there with me as well. Just, just, there's just no way. There is just no freaking way. Right. Anyway. Ooh, wow, no. Okay, let go. Bye-bye now. I'm a little bit geeked out. The t-shirt, I have to show you this because I have lost quite a bit of weight in like the last few weeks I've noticed. If so, if you remember me originally uh, recording an episode with my t-shirt on and it was, it was quite tie fitting. Look at this. I am losing a lot of weight. So as you can see, I have literally shed quite a few pounds completely. It, it now does not fit me and that's the lady's end, but it's quite comfortable and it's nice and long, so you know, I'm not going to complain. Um, ever with anything else in terms of update is the fact that um, today I had confirmation of two more viewings for places in London when I go up. So I have confirmation for Monday afternoon, hopefully confirmation Monday afternoon, I have to double check that, and a confirmation for two for Tuesday afternoon. So. That's going quite well, I'm quite happy with that. Um, other than that, uh, I'm slowly getting along with my cosplay. <laughs> I have done nothing about packing from moving to London. It's, so it's just a confirmation that's happened this week, which is really nice, it, it picked me up a little bit. Um, and I have to get on with more cosplay. It's gloriously, gloriously lovely out there. Just, just glorious, I have to show you. Ooh, look at that lighting. Darcy, say hi. Say hi, Darcy. Hi, Darcy. Hi, Darcy. <laughs> Darcy says hi. It's it's amazing. You would not think that it was nearly eight o'clock. Look at that weather. <laughs> it was a bit touch and go like it really chucked it down with rain but I, I i always watch the weather because i need to know what the weather is doing because i say cool and i was like it's fine it's fine i didn't bother taking my raincoat thank god because it's so hot and sticky in it but yeah it was fine and i'm fine and it's just ah but yes so thunder is 1965 kickstarter rewards arrived whoop and i've got confirmation for a definite two more viewings so that is it it is um Gone midnight on Tuesday, so technically it's Wednesday. Uh, I haven't, I haven't vlogged for the last three days. Um, Saturday I got back and I completely forgot I was meant to be doing like this Eurovision thing, watching Eurovision with my fates through Skype and Facebook, because we were doing this little, uh, oh bingo thing where we picked a number and whatever number it was was the country that was representing us and so we see who won one of my mates won because she picked Australia and Australia was sec was the highest out of all of us so well done her <laughs> she got Australia 
Sunday. I was planning to hopefully get stuff started, but the waistband of the skirt took me a whole lot longer than I would have liked, and by about six o'clock I had a headache and I was just just get get it done get all the sewing done and with the sewing machine and just just get it done and that was it and then I caught up with Penny Dreadful and watched uh the first episode of season one of Game of Thrones because I had to rewatch it I'm about halfway through originally of season one of Game of Thrones and I was like no I need to need to catch up and I haven't gone up for the last two days um uh, Monday again um just worked pretty much it really uh yeah I've just you know been at my job past two days hasn't really dawned on me yet that I am leaving for London on Sunday probably will be Friday this is all going Thursday so in about just over a day family are coming back from Barcelona later today uh because I said it's technically Wednesday it's Tuesday oh they, they can come back tomorrow morning um so they're probably, I think, going to be here about lunchtime-ish. I've already prepared tea today. I've been a very good girl. Um, I cleaned the house. I, blitz, I blitzed through the house. I uh, cleaned the kitchen. I'd even washed the, you know, dusted down all the counters, wiped down the counters, hoovered and mopped the floor. And then I did the sitting room. And then I've done the hallway. And then I had to do the man cave come sewing room because this is what I left in a bit of a day yesterday I was just finalizing like all the accessory bits and my hat which has got to have like I've done like different color crosses you will get it when 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 I vlog about when I'm, I'm dressing up for that now I, I pulled down all my suitcases um started packing and actually started packing and sorting out what I was taking what's staying here and what's going to be in another suitcase when I eventually get a place I have three confirmed viewings for next week. I've just got to overconfirm one for Monday and another one for Tuesday. And I've got to phone people up. I know I've got to phone one person up this uh, Friday and I've got to phone a couple of others as well on Friday. So hopefully we have some more viewings. Um, one of the places I was looking at for an agency, the price has changed and it's even more in my favour and I really, really want it because it's a studio flat and it'd be like my own place and I really, really want it. Other than that, nothing else has really happened. Um, I'm sorry about the lateness of me finishing off last, uh, the, the previous week's vlog. As I said, I've just, I just, I just haven't been very good the past couple of days and the past two mornings I've woken up with a really sore throat. No idea why. Just just woke up with a sore throat. I think it's because I haven't been drinking a lot in the evenings. I need to need to get on with that. I think I've had a lot more to drink. I'm on like my, my second glass of milk. Cold milk, just just milk. I just it's really nice and it makes me sleepy. Because I need sleep. I do need sleep. So, um apologies again on how very erratic this vlog has been. Um thank you very much for putting my erraticness. And I will see you in the next video. Uh, um, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye YouTube.